I want to address something I heard yesterday <laughs> on the after show as I was driving home. I was very entertained. Of course, the uh, lovely and talented Otto yeah. of Otto and George hung out for the after show with uh, young Sam Roberts. And uh, they were talking. It was very entertaining. And then, I don't know how it even got brought up, but um, we found out we have a budding uh, film writer. I think I was asking E-Rock about, like, he seems very, like, he's reached a point where he's <coughs> content here and that he doesn't right. seem to be motivated to to go the extra mile. Like, he's not a upwards moving guy anymore. Did you he, have any, uh, did you have any prior knowledge that he was doing this or not? Absolutely not. And so I said, I just said, well, what would you do if the show went away? So if there's no uh -huh. place to move here. What would you do? Right. And he informed me that he had some things he was working on. And one of those was he had recently purchased software to for screenwriting. Good. He got the software. Do you get final draft? Yes. Yeah. That's what he got. Because he's got the idea. He's got his movie. He's got the idea. He's, so, he's, writing, he's writing a movie. He's writing e -Rock a film. is writing a film. Now, have you ever written a film before? No. Okay. Eric Nagel, the movie, is Nagel. coming to theaters. Nagel. We don't know a lot about it. He's being very mysterious. About very him. mysterious. I listened. You and Otto were doing a good job grilling him. Oh, thank yesterday. you. Yesterday. Uh, but there were some questions that were unanswered. He does. He wants part of the whole. He doesn't have a script yet, but part of selling the script will be he's going to have to maintain some sort of say over who gets cast. Casting in yes. the film that will go away. By the way, uh, soundtrack. Yes, he wants that's, soundtrack. That's, that's written into gone. It. Yeah, he and, wants that. Too. And he would like a producer credit. He doesn't see himself as a director. No. But a writer producer. Writer producer. Well, you'll get a writer credit, of casting. course. No, casting. Casting and music. Here's what they'll say. Uh, uh, you're you going to get a writing credit. That's well, what you get. Here's your money. Well, Jimmy, you better hope he gets casting uh, privileges because <laughs> you're going to be cast in this film. Ooh. I am? I heard. Right. That's what oh, I heard. Gee. He has a role specifically in mind for you. E-Rock, comment. Wow. Oh, I said that. That's true. All right. What? Now, let's uh, reiterate some of the stuff <laughs> I heard yesterday. What is this movie about? Yeah, I didn't really explain that too much. No, you didn't. No. A little bit, though. One of the main plot points you did, like where, you know, not where, but when. When. It would be taking oh. place. Yeah. What? It starts in present time. Uh-huh. Oh. But um, quickly goes back into the uh, the end of the 40s. The end of the 40s. All right. So it's it's <laughs> I know what it's about. Uh-huh. It's it's about it's your life from high school on. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's not that old. Okay, so so it goes back to the 40s. It goes back to the 40s. Right. So now there's a guy, right? Mm -hmm. Obviously he's at the end of his life. <clears throat> in, no. In, well, no, in in present day. <laughs> no. 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 It opens in the present. Yeah. How old is the guy? How old is the guy about? in the present? Uh, 18, 19. Oh, okay. All right. He's young. And then he goes back to the 40s? Yes. Now, does he know about the future when he goes back to the 40s? Yes. And does he have, like, an attitude? Like, is he a cool guy? Is he, like, Bill from Bill and Ted? No. Does no. he introduce things like LOL to the 40s? <laughs> OMG. Yeah. As time goes on, he changes things in history and makes it his own. Oh. <laughs> so he Ooh. has. Does he have a picture of his, him and his brother and sister that slowly disappear? <laughs> yeah. He has a, a, a future machine? No. A past machine? No. No. It, it's, not, it's not a. There's no like sci fi element to it where for the time travel thing. It's just something happens. Oh, he just, I'm not getting Okay, it. obviously. He, he knocks and his it, head. And he, and he winds up he being back his head. in this in this time period. And it goes and <laughs> has to live the rest of his life going through time. Yeah. Yeah. But with not no he has to live the rest of his life going through time, knowing what he knows about the future. Uh huh. So he might start inventing things. Like he probably buys up dot com stuff in the forties, forty years before it means anything. What? Things like that. The forties. How do you do that? What is now he compared it to the Jerry O'Connell series, Sliders. No, I didn't. I think you, you did. did no. <laughs> I heard that part. I never saw that series. It was ridiculous. It stunk. Um, <laughs> it stunk. <laughs> you never want to hear that your series stunk. <laughs> stunk. <laughs> I thought it was more like Voyagers <laughs> from the uh, 80s. Uh, Iraq. So there's this guy. He's 18. He goes back to the 40s. 
Now, hey, there, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. Uh, he, he goes back to the 40s, well beyond when he was born. And does he immediately start, like, fucking with things? No. What does he do first? I don't want to give a lot of this out because it hasn't <laughs> been finished. <laughs> God. Oh, God. And he also... I want to know... Eric, Eric didn't want to give the title of the movie away. Right. Due to copyright concerns. He's got a title, yeah. but he won't tell I us what it is. I have a whole bunch of notes and everything else. I just want to put it all together. If you want it... If you want it yeah. copywritten and everything. But you, you should do that, but the one way... A little cheap, easy way to do it. Print it all out and mail it to yourself yeah. through the U.S. mail. It doesn't hold up anymore. No? No, no. they can't do that. That doesn't work. That's I bullshit. I that in the 90s. That's well, horseshit. Well, 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 Esquire says no. That's horseshit. Why? Because you have to go through the, you have to send it to the uh, Library of Congress. No, 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 no I know that, but I'm saying as as a temporary thing. And no, while you're doesn't, doing that, doesn't, doesn't hold do, up. Doesn't hold, doesn't hold up. up in court. Wow, I wonder why. It just doesn't. I, I tried doing that, and and then uh, I called up SAG, and they were like, "No, you have to, you have to send it to the Library of Congress." And it takes a long time to send us back. Oh, I had a kid fuck me because I wrote a script with two dudes, and one of the kids got a little loopy, and we were like. I had, to, I had to copyright it, and oh, I tried man. doing that, but that shit didn't work. I like got, the Nagel. Yeah. My film, lawyer told filmmaker. me that. He's a what? <laughs> he's a filmmaker. Yeah, he's, a filmmaker. he's writing a film. See, Bob. here's what's happening. We found out yesterday huh? that Eric Nagel Eric. Yeah. is writing a film. That's great. He's writing a film, uh, and we're trying to... He already got the software to write the final draft. <laughs> oh, you got to do that first. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah, he's, not, he's not using a quill, right? Right, right. right. So oh, now good. we're trying then to figure out the game. what, what game. this is about. So far, here's what we got. Right. Starts in present time, 2013-ish, around that. 19-year-old? Uh, 18, 19-year-old guy. Cool guy. Somehow. Without, don't fucking Stop say time machine, because it ain't no time machine. Right. But somehow, this guy goes back to the late 40s. I think he's on a boat or something. Maybe, he maybe he's like doing some fishing. And, and like the clouds swoop down. Oh. And it's a, yeah. And all of a sudden, he comes out, and the lake is the same. But he can't find his car on the lake. Wait a minute. Where's my car? Yeah, yeah. Where's my car? You... And he go So you could do the Foley work for him. Yeah. He yeah, go no, yeah. he goes down. He gets caught in a storm, and he goes down. Oh. And then there's a, a there's, there's a little creature named Chaka come and guide him. <laughs> uh, a bunch of stacks. Yeah, sleep er stacks. Eric's original idea was that he would go and travel what through the decades. What word did you just use? Original okay, go idea. Ahead. Oh. Was that he would travel through the decades via time vortexes, like the Jerry O'Connell series ah. sliders. That was you again. I, uh, <laughs> does he use You said something about sliders No, yesterday. you Maybe said that, and I told you know. Does he use a phone yeah, booth sandwiches. to travel in time? No. No phone booth. No phone booth. You know all what this right. show does? Kills dreams. <laughs> exactly. That's all this show does. <laughs> This show just Why kills. Try. You're right. Listen, this show does nothing for any of us except <laughs> you're right. Except maybe eight people at a fucking gig in Albany. You're right. <laughs> Let However, me tell you something. This this kid has a hope. He has a hope. Talk to his chick. Yeah, yeah. He's probably one of his parents. <laughs> he talked. Maybe about confide this. in one of these assholes when they were actually. He talked to no, and, 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 and no, everybody went. You, you know what? You did. Go ahead, man. That's not that you got to do, dude. You got to do multiple. Dude, you can't man. just do one thing and give him a penny. He went, yeah. And idea. he went and bought the stuff. And then he sat down one night and cleared off the desk. And he went, honey. <laughs> I'm and she write came a in. Movie. I bet his wife peeked in and went, ooh. Got oh. excited that he's starting to do it. Yeah. And everybody's happy for him. And then he comes in here. Ugh. And now he's going to, I guarantee he's going to go home and fucking <laughs> destroy whatever office is in his fucking Jersey <laughs> shit town. <laughs> That's not what happened, though. Here's, this, here's how he got the this, this script writing software. His wife got so tired of being married to this fucking <laughs> Lego-making lump, she brought home Final Draft and said, Dude, write, do something. <laughs> write a movie. Well, if Norton, you know what? You know what, Norton? Your show on Wednesdays is really... Thank God it's here. You are. You help people. Because <laughs> you're right. You probably want to do something, you cocksucker. Yeah, you stop playing Legos. How do you expect me to get turned on by you? You're playing Legos. You push write a movie, shit dick. <laughs> hello? Hello? That's all you do all the... Hello? Hello? Ah, enough. Here, write a movie. <laughs> and he said that, like... Go, he go, starts in 2013. Right, right. Goes back to the 40s. 1940s. But then and travels through the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s. That's such 90s, a shit time to go back to. And 2000s in under 90 minutes. Why would you go back to the 40s? That's right when the fucking <laughs> world sucked. Dude. I don't think he had a choice. Why? I think mistake. he got thrown back somehow because he doesn't have a time machine. He stepped in a hole he or would, something. He would, be good, he would be good I in the 40s. I bet he hits his head. 
And a guy hits his head, huh. and he, he's like, oh, oh, huh. oh. And he's like, hey, what are you doing there? <laughs> yeah. Ah, wait a minute. I was just... Hi. Hey, pal, you fell down and hit your head. What are you up to? 23 Skidoo. Oh, 23 Skidoo. LOL, that's funny. What do you mean, LOL? Who's law? Ah, I don't understand what you're talking about. Does he check a newspaper? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he checks the newspaper, sees the date. He's like, oh, my God. And then he's walking through, like, Times Square, and he sees, like, that guy kiss the girl. And, and, he, goes, goes, and he, has that. That, he has that somewhere in time moment. He said the sound of Penny. He pulls a hoagie out of his pocket, and he sees the, the maid on date. With the sticker. <laughs> he's fucking, he's in paradise because a hoagie is, like, 50 cents. Yeah. <laughs> no, not, they're not even invented yet. Yeah. Some, some some uh, del- diner owner was like, "This is a great idea. What a grand idea!" <laughs> yeah, he, uh, he he invertedly invented the hoagie. <laughs> is there food related inventions in the uh, film? You're not coming. There's no. no food so you don't do anything with computers. He becomes the hoagie king of Long Island. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, he, inv- he starts inventing everything. He gets a pancake oh. and s- someone steps on it and it's the waffle. Oh my well, god. What are you doing? They're not all winners. <laughs> oh, it's like, oh, wait a minute. I dropped my iPhone. iPhone? What about your phone? On my phone? What are you talking about, iPhone? What is this? You gotta use the phone. There's one in there. <laughs> Oh, my God. I can't what? believe it. I have to check Twitter. Twitter? What is that, a bird? <laughs> See, he could do all these yeah. wacky things, yeah. but the guy yeah. doesn't understand what he's saying. He's taking notes in there. Oh, yeah. e writing like a maniac. Is that what's going to happen, E-Rock? Oh, is he going to have some awkward moments like that where he mentions something about the future? Yeah. It's, it's mainly a drama, but he said there are a lot of comedic elements. I would hope so. Did he say, like, download? <laughs> yeah. They don't know what that is. And then he oh, goes, yeah. oh, nerds. I forgot where I am. Ah. No, no. <laughs> what made you decide the late 40s? the time I picked. <laughs> E-Rock also, no yeah. does he <laughs> jump through time or does he in the 40s and now he's got to live his whole life? He's got to live his whole life. Holy shit. So he's got to go back That's to... a long movie. He's going to go back to not where he was. day by day. It's only 90, 90 minutes. minutes. It's it. under, under 90 minutes. Under 90 minutes? Definitely. He said From under 90 minutes. From the 40s till 2015? <laughs> Can I ask you a question though? You haven't written it yet. How do you know it's under 90 minutes? Don't you have to like write it and then? Eric has broad strokes. You can't sell a, a long movie. You know, fucking movie. Just ask Terry Gino. It's impossible. impossible. Yeah, yeah but he already just look at those Lord of the Rings flops. There's a yeah. movie. <laughs> J- JFK sucked. Again, established. I, yeah. Ninety minutes is like old Godzilla movies on Channel Five. <laughs> <laughs> fucking every movie is at least two hours now. It's my favorite Patrice joke ever. What he did? He did Godzilla. Run. <laughs> he used to do Godzilla. <laughs> 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 what if this movie, seriously, we're about yeah. kill, and in two, three years, it's a oh, fucking God. mega hit. E-Rock's accepting the Oscar up there, and we're all like, what the fuck happened? Yeah. You just see Norton sucked. jump off the, fu- the oh, top absolutely. of the theater with Why a noose around yes. him. I'll be a part of the movie. Yes. You'll be in the film. I'm gonna Are you going to well, be in it? True. In the yes. 40s part. part. Best supporting the actor. 40s. Oh, Jimmy does have a part. Jim yeah. Norton. What's my name in the movie? I haven't, got, I haven't given a name, but I have... Mm-hmm. Sort of the look and Chip, the way you're Can I just say it. something though? You have Edgar? to. You should have names. Yeah, you I, should have like your the I name have a of the guy too, and I don't have that yet. <laughs> no, I'm it. just trying to give you. I'm not trying to hurt you. I'm oh, trying to gee, help you. Bob, don't give the guy such a hard time. Ah. <laughs> I'm going to get in character now. <laughs> yeah, that is good. I can do it. So ah. he, he lives his life. From don't give the, me any guff. You yeah. got a lot of moxie. Hey, quiet, <laughs> you mug. <laughs> He you lives his it. life from the 40s in real time after that. There's no Not more time in travel. Real time. It, no, but there's, I'm saying there's no more time travel. That's right. There's Let's no more buckle talk. There's no more time uh. travel, but the movie does jump to different parts in his life as oh. he's grow, living through so, that time. So oh. if we, we could go from the 40s and then see what he's doing in the 60s. Yeah. Does, does he go to, oh, he go to Woodstock? Man. Does he go to Woodstock? That would be cool. No, has Groovy like man. Do you, know how difficult, <laughs> yeah. do you know how difficult it is to write? That a type period of period piece to write that shit to go back write a period piece but then to jump ahead and back oh my you know, god he's setting himself up <laughs> for uh, the most difficult writing task yeah, yeah. of all how about he's not you jumping do something back, like though? fucking clerks first why don't you do that you're yeah. not jumping back though once you go back in time it just goes forward yeah but no he goes forward yeah but you go you said you said you go back and forth this is no, a no, no, epic. no no it's the, it the very minutes. beginning of the movie yeah. is current, is current time right but it jumps right back to that time well, he period, goes the and he's got to live his life. <laughs> it's not a slider. <laughs> somebody, I hope somebody right now is on Netflix finding this exact movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Does yeah. he go through the Stargate? 
No. It's not a Stargate? No. Oh, okay. Now, are there references to the civil rights struggle in no. the 1950s? Is there, what do you mean, me, no? He's living through the 50s. There's me, nothing about the civil rights. No. Uh, uh, let me Damn. ask you a question. Let me ask you. Let me ask he's you only question. got like 10 minutes. Is he, <laughs> is he down at Atlantic City, and does he come across like a, a machine, a fortune-telling machine, and then oh. something happens? No. no. Does he get That's younger? Big. No. Yeah. Oh. I wish I was in the late 40s. <laughs> when you are, when you're casting, do you want Robert Loja? <laughs> Quickly. Oh, He's Don Knotts. I wish I was. I Robert wish I was a Loja. fish. <laughs> so in the know. 50s, is he like, and then he like says something about like the internet, and they're like, internet? What do you fish with that? Oh! Ba 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 Something like that? Yeah, they're all flexing their muscles and moving their fists back yeah, and yeah. forth. <laughs> like, like Bowser, of uh, course. I think Eric just wants to make a really cool soundtrack. Uh, is that it? So, yeah, so he's just doing From all the, 40s, the decades. Yeah. And then the 60s, it and could be, you know. think of a movie around boom, doom, doom, that. Boom, 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 Are there doom, disco scenes? It's a time... Of the season, <laughs> bow, bow, bow. Oh, and then they'll be wait. like fucking Vietnam. Da, 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 da. Yeah, it's beautiful, man. Da, 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 da. And the guy's like, "Oh my god, I got drafted. I'm in he'll, the Nam." He'll already be forty in the '60s, so oh, you right. won't even have that like drama of, of the Nam going to war. What's yeah. he doing in the '60s? He's forty years old. He's like, wait till you guys see wait. what happens to Richard fucking Nixon. What's it? You guys are going to love this. I'm not going to say it, because I don't want to really alter history, but just pay attention to this. Watergate Hotel. Nuff said. <laughs> Nuff said. And then he goes back to the 50s. Wasn't Woodstock so, uh, in so, 1969? Yeah. So, so Anthony, he's going to be like in his late 40s yeah. to go to Woodstock. Right, well, yeah. at Woodstock. So in the movie, I he's going to be really <laughs> smart when he goes back. Oh, yeah. He's going to know everything he's from... Gonna, Okay. From 2013. Okay. Right. And then he goes back and apparently does nothing with it because Iraq <laughs> has him doing nothing. No, I'm just not telling you. Why are you what not telling us? Because it's not done. Why am I well, going to give you what all are your the details, details when it's I'll not done? You, I'll bet you the guy does something really inane like he invents gravy boats. <laughs> it's just some worthless job. <laughs> gravy boats. <laughs> Iraq, you could kind of communicate what no, you're can't. thinking. No. Which one, one thing because he does? One, it's publicly being said. It's not taken care <laughs> I of. I wouldn't sweat it. <laughs> <laughs> let's, just, let's just get a hold of ourselves here yeah. and give us a couple of Who's nuggets. Who's going to steal the idea to animate a radio show? Yeah, let's talk about that. That's true. Are you saying Ricky Gervais is going to steal your fucking I'm idea? I'm saying a lot of people have. <laughs> I don't oh, think... it's wonderful. He goes back to the 40s. <laughs> and he goes back to the 40s. And then he comes back and he's in the 60s. Yeah, and he invents all kinds of stuff. Eric is pitching like Benjamin Button. It's not like yeah, this yeah, is an yeah. original idea. Exactly. That somebody's going to take. Time travel has been dealt with in movies. Exactly. Contrary to popular sucker. belief. Hey, hey, fucking chip. chip. Garbage chip. chip. Rock, fucking movie sucks. Take your damn hey. hands off her. Does that happen in the movie? <laughs> do you do you punch Biff? Yeah. yeah. Want to go all back? I'm thinking about. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Eric is actually just pitching Forrest Gump, except the beginning is slightly different. <laughs> Forrest Plump. <laughs> 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 I made that joke yesterday. No, I said Forrest uh, Gut. Forrest Gut uh, yesterday. <laughs> and, then I, and then right after I said it, and I was walking into my house, after I hung up the phone, I'm like, shit, I should have said Forrest Plump. <laughs> Plump's a better word. Yes. <laughs> Sounds more like gum. But it is. Just instead of sitting at a bus stop, he falls through a slider's time portal, and then oh, he has to yeah. start his life. Oh, that's over. true. Maybe there's, an, there's a telephone booth that he gets into. Something like yeah. that. Yeah. Or gets stuck in. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they call it the curious case of Benjamin and Jerry's. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. It's, yeah. it's, it's the, ah, it's the, curi funny. the curious man. case of popped buttons. <laughs> so <you can> <laughs> <laughs> Does he go through historical things? Like, are there things that oh. really happen that we live yeah. through? Anything? Yeah. You rock comment? Uh, yeah, uh, but... Oh, he does. but not the big historical things? No. Like not little the, ones? Not the, yeah, little things. <laughs> yeah? Like, like fucking, like Mrs. Johnson's fucking flat tire, he fixes it? Something like that, instead of like, stopping the Korean War? <laughs> Anything? Zach, instead of warning JFK? Yeah. Just something really stupid. Uh, what about that? Does he, does he get to warn anybody of any impending doom? No. Like, He's, why? No, I, I know what he does. He does little things, like he changes somebody's tire. But what he doesn't realize yeah. is changing that tire is the butterfly effect that sets off. And the Korean War butterfly does. Effect. Yeah, but what you should call it butterfly well, effect. That's right. Yeah. How about we're butterball oh. guys? <laughs> Peanut butter. <laughs> <fly>. <laughs> he, Anthony, he's gonna he, he's yeah. gonna actually <laughs> he's gonna save ball. President yeah. Kennedy. Yeah. <laughs> On the way up the, to the book support, whatever, the, the book fucking depository. 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 Depository.
He actually sees a new vending machine. <laughs> then you hear, as he's putting his Snickers down his throat. Oh, jeez. <laughs> well, what he'll do is he'll save Kennedy. Yeah. Not knowing that Kennedy starts a nuclear war in 1967. Right. <laughs> oh, and then you get back to fucking 2013, and it's like fucking like the Terminator. Did yeah. I get it right, Eric? Is it little things that lead to big things that yeah. he doesn't realize? Are you calling it the no. butterfly effect? No. Are you, is it the butterfly effect? Keep saying. Do you have to stop effect. Cyberdyne? Is it sliders? <laughs> Do you have to stop sliders? No? You don't go back and stop Cyberdyne? No. <laughs> what cat, what's, what's the uh, name of, one of, my, of my character? I said I don't have a name for your character. What's the name of your character? Well, I don't have I don't have the names yet. What <laughs> actors have been cast as possible roles? I haven't cast the whole thing. I but, wrote yeah, but who? with certain people. All right, so that's what I'm asking you. In The Terminator. <laughs> The Terminator. All right, that was Jesus. Good. What? I've been that on was the, good. I can't. Yeah. Right. I've been on the other end of this one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yesterday. <laughs> so, so who besides Jim has been cast in the film? Yeah. Who do you see as the lead? First of all, well, who do you see as the lead? I don't know. Yet. We all know Come who on. the lead. Come on. Is. Now, when you think about a movie and Jim. writing movie, the first <laughs> thing you kind of goes through your head is a celebrity that you would want playing yeah. the different parts. <clears throat> you had to have an idea right now. You have the idea of your lead character. Who does he look like? Who does he like? Like, what celebrity would... Is it a Brad Pitt? Or is it a fucking... Um, like an Owen Wilson? The, the, the guinea with the big nose? Oh. What? He was good in the piano. <laughs> yeah. He was in King Kong. <laughs> Pianist. I mean... He was in King Kong. Yeah, that guy. And he's in that fucking... Adrian Brody. Yeah. Adrian Brody. Oh! Fucking dick nose. Yeah, whatever. Is it an Adrian Brody? No, no. Is it fucking... Uh, is it fucking John McClane? Hulk Hogan? <laughs> is it is running out of buildings, exploding? Uh, yeah, yeah. No. Maybe it's Dwayne, no is it Dwayne Johnson? <laughs> oh, oh, The Rock. I would see that. Yeah, I would see that. I'd see that. Fucking The Rock? Is, is it Undertaker? <laughs> he's too old, though. He's 18. We need, like, a young oh, uh, fucking guy from, yeah, the like, Rock Twilight. Could still be, yeah, but The Rock could still be one of the guys from, you know, in, in the back in the time. Well, true. He could be the older guy. He gets old. You gotta cast this. The lead has to be cast <laughs> multiple times because he gets older. Dude, how many fucking... No, they can do uh, makeup. He didn't think of that. <laughs> <laughs> but from 18 to like 70... Oh, right. God. Like Benjamin Button. Oh, man. Is it just going to be like bad makeup? Putin. No. no. You Benjamin are really that. fucking... When they take yeah. a 20-year-old guy... They just take crusty paint. Yeah. They, make, they put crusty paint on his neck. By the way, the answer to is it going to be really bad makeup is he will have no choice. <laughs> now he's doing the makeup, too. Yeah. What's oh, this that? is an independent film. Yeah. Oh, this is, a low, no, is this low budget? He's or is looking this... for a backing from major uh, studios. Right. right. He needs a director. Yeah. Looking to sell it. What? Oh. So, oh, you don't even care about it. You just want to sell it, make He's the money, and get another sell one. It. Yes. So I don't get like. Well, who's been cast? Yeah, what who, actors who, I have? Haven't cast anybody? Who do you you just said Jim Norton has a role. Who there else? There's a does? character that Jim came to mind, and that's and I developed something around who Jim. Who else do you have characters in mind for? Just Jim. I or? have other characters written, not full detail, but just little descriptions on certain people. But I haven't picked. Is Jim like, the guy that? that the, Jim more. the guy that when they do the time travel, it doesn't work right, and is and he comes out half done. <laughs> <laughs> half done. Me. Oh shit. You're all coming. That's you. Uh, shut up, Chip. Oh, it's just God. a little, it's, it's, a, it's a little Bobo-ish to, like, be writing a movie and to have only so far cast people I know. who are on yeah. the show. Right. Yeah. Somebody, yeah. somebody so inspired him. Opie. No one else was cast. <laughs> is Opie the lead? Nobody else was oh, cast. Oh, 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 Opie's the lead. He is. Opie and Hulk. Obvious. Opie and Hulk the Hulk. Oh. He wants to just fucking one day drop a script in front of Opie and say, I got something for you. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And Opie will finally look at him like an equal. I have you in mind. I'll be able to like, I read your script. I think uh, you can play a variety yeah, of ages. Opie, yeah. no, Opie spills his Cheerios and blueberries on it. Yeah. <laughs> That's away from me. It's out of my way. So, all right. The guy's 18. He goes back in time. He starts affecting history in some way or another. He goes what's, through the sliders portal. What's to get the there. hook? There's no sliders portal. What's the hook? Yeah. You're going to have this follow this guy from the 40s yes, yeah. up to modern times. Yeah. What is happening during that? What, what's the hook? Not the one you cut your mouth on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, let's erase that part. What happens, Iraq? Um... <laughs> What goes on that's through? That's, that's a lot the, of years. I know you don't want to give it away, but I, I'm sure it's a, a lot of years. Give us something, because you have a 70-year span with a 19-year-old yeah. actor. Jesus. <laughs> I mean, there, no, I don't want to give anything away. Oh, my <laughs> God. Just one thing. There's got to be something that happens through history. This is one thing, E-Rock. Like, don't worry. No one's going to steal it. Yeah. 
This is Back to the Future and fucking yeah. Terminator and every other goddamn time travel movie. If the yeah. only time travel thing happens in the very beginning, what is that hook that keeps everybody? Slight. Right. Is there... Uh, yeah. <laughs> Something's gonna happen that this guy has to stop. Maybe there's another... Maybe he <laughs> runs into another sliders portal and he realizes, you know what? I'm gonna stay. Ladies and gentlemen, if you look out the windows... You'll see the 1935 World's Fair. Does oh. that happen? No. Is it a plane? Because that's 35. Well, the 35, sorry. No, Not something's going to happen in present time. Yeah. And um, maybe it's an iPhone the, app. The boy goes oh. back. Yeah. And then has to stop what's going to happen in the present time. <laughs> just to disaster. Like, I'll bet it's something really topical, like oh. nuclear weapons are flying. No, but oh, hopefully, no. hopefully that's his movie being written. <laughs> 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 he has to go back in time to break Eric's fucking hands. <laughs> I love that. You were just talking about how people get shit on with their <laughs> dreams. And you just step right it's up. Addictive. And rip your pants look, down and look, take a big dump. This is what I know about this show. It's coming. Yeah. That's all you that's that's true. Look, I'm, I'm getting some in right now. I hear you. And the fucking, the fat jokes are coming. I hear you. No, they're not. Not today. Shut your fucking little cabs coming in. That fucking midget. There is no action. There are no action sequences. No action sequences, right? It's not an action movie? Not at no. all. There's a, no action? It's a drama with a bit of comedic element. You're coming out of the gate with a drama? And some romance. And a Ooh. slider's portal. Hey, doll. There's no sliders. <laughs> Does your romantic interest give you the clap in 1950? I'm going to be writing this Because she's got a bad rep. Like, this really needs a slider's portal. Yeah. And that's the way it's going to go well, Give down. us some. Tell us one. Thing. Come on, Iraq. We're, we're, we're fucking clamoring here. Like, if you pitch this. Yeah. You're gonna have to tell them something. Yeah, I'd pitch it once it was done. Oh God! Are you gonna right fight? Now, I'm not just... pitching it in the beginning. What hooks the seventy? Are you years fighting span? vampires? Are the vampires no. in it? No werewolves. No, no sci-fi. None of that. Is, nonsense. Yeah, but that's not sci-fi. Vampires. Is it, is it like Last Action Hero, where some characters <laughs> come to the movie stuff. screen? Is no, that no, it? no, no. Comment, Iraq? No, no. Can you fly? No. You know, superhero well, no. expression. <laughs> <laughs> so what is it that keeps everybody hooked for those 70 years? Yeah. Uh, what, 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 he just locked the theater doors? <laughs> what he does throughout that period and coming to a realization when he makes it back to the time when he knew he went back to begin with. He doesn't, have, he doesn't get to meet himself, does it's he? Terrible. Uh, Are you going to give Fred Savage this treatment? <laughs> <laughs> Is he the old man that the kid was talking to in the beginning? i got to give him my treatment. No, <laughs> no, no. no. Oh, like no. the old man gave him some advice and then he realizes it was him. he was do the you old give, man. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh. A, 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 do you give a sports almanac to yourself? <laughs> yes. <when> you get... <laughs> Did you go back in time and become a not shitty radio guy? <laughs> <laughs> So come on, you're rocking rock? something. Oh, What's man? the hook? Tell does us he, something. Does he meet himself as an old guy meeting himself as a young 18-year-old guy? He doesn't meet, him, meet himself, but he finds out what happens to himself. The 18-year-old finds out what happens no, to himself? No, the, the old man finds out what happens after everything he did. What old man? Oh, oh so, so he goes Wait. back, he does some shit, and then he sees like what happened to his 18-year-old self because of what he did. Yeah. He doubles himself. So his 18-year-old so self confused. still lives in 2013 while his, another... He, he lives in two places at once? If you see each other, it can make a paradox <laughs> that can destroy the universe! <laughs> once he goes, like that, that don't make no sense! Oh, Jesus. Once he goes into the sliders portal, he doesn't exist in 2013 anymore. <laughs> yeah, it's fucking sliders, cocksucker. Oh, damn. Jesus, Ed. He's Chip. Garbage. Chip, let him be creative. Chip doesn't know what sliders is. Yeah, I do. What is it? It's fucking, I don't know. It's <laughs> sliders. It's about tiny hamburgers. <laughs> That's that. What, yeah, of course. That was his motivation from um, the beginning. Yeah. So, okay. Like Pez. So he fucking... <laughs> <laughs> So he, he, okay, I see what happened. Now, is he purposefully trying to change things to change his own life through history, or he just so happens to be skipping through life uh, throughout these years and then goes, oh, my God, I didn't realize what I did affected me? Come on. It could. And Give us a scene. Does that no. be the climax? A scene. Oh, no. It, how does everybody? What do all his friends Angry. think when he disappeared? When he's 19 years old in 2013, and then he just disappears for the next 70 years? Well, he doesn't disappear. Well, he goes back in time. But he's he's at 2013. Yeah, he's let's still say in 2013. And then he goes back in time. He doesn't disappear because he's 
But the by young the time him you get, is back into is back in the 1940s. So how can the young him also you be in that not, part of the story? Because yet. it's it hasn't been 2013 right. yet. Stupid. But he doesn't exist <laughs> anymore. Yeah, but it doesn't matter because they, that hasn't happened yet. But to the, he went back. But to the other people who are living, it does. So oh all of a God. sudden, he just becomes a seventy-year-old. He's still he, there. He meets his mom and falls in love with her and has sex and makes him. Oh, he fucking he's, he's, oh. he's his own he dad. He invents the shaved pussy back in the forties. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Actually, the shaved wow, pussy this was is, in. This is pretty. I like this. It's I'm nice. That down. The shaved pussy was invented way before that. No. That's how, yeah, they did. The whores back in the old west days shaved. They did not. Pu- they did. So they thought that prevented um, uh, disease. What did they do? They used to the 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 stand in the old barber chairs. They used to make them wear uh, the little uh, what are they called? The uh, wigs Chastity for the belt? pussies. What are they called? Pussy wigs. A merkin. Oh. Merkins, and that's where uh, they were made out of beaver pelt, and that's where the beaver came from. Stop oh. it! I swear to God, and you they were also, are so full of shit. I swear to fuck. No, he's how probably can, right. How can I make that up out he, of the fucking blue? It's hilarious. And they connected, but the beaver part. Yeah. And he's also. I bet you so they didn't get crabs or lice. Yeah, they used to shave. You knew a woman was a prostitute because if she had a shaved pussy, because the crabs and all that stuff. They they how thought they get it would. Pre- back then. I, uh, you know, I don't think you did. <laughs> I think you just got to been to shave your pussy back then. With what a straight razor? I don't know. How and, they... and that thing where you take the shaving cream and go <laughs> and mix it up. <laughs> the brush. Yeah, yeah. One one wrong move and fucking you got two slugs on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> you got a Clint Eastwood asking you questions. Which yeah. way did he go? Uh, he slices your pussy a little. <laughs> Is that so? All right, Iraq. Back Come on, to you. Iraq. I'm using that. Give us. Uh, yeah, he's using that for his his treatment. He can't. Iraq. Iraq. You gotta give us one thing that happens through history with this main character that sort of has a, a an impact on his future self. Does he get angry and just run for years and grow a beard? Oh, that can happen. It's <laughs> a good one. Jot that in. From all happens. Comes a shrimp fisherman. Shrimp. Uh, what happens? One thing for the love of God. You're writing this. You're very excited about yes, it. Yes, but I'm not pumped. pitching this. Get well, people give us pumped. one scene. That's not going to blow your movie. How about yeah. one thing that happens with Jim's character? Because you've obviously thought about Jim's character. Yeah, what do I do? Jim is a... Um, he runs a radio station in New York City. He's an old-timey what uh, year? GM. What year is he in? 40s. Jim shows up like 51. Oh, 52. 1951. Right, Flash! Yeah, around there, right when... Uh, <laughs> yeah, that'd be good. Rock and roll kind of beep, starts. Beep, 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 beep. Flash! He's, oh, hey, but he, hey, Helen, who's this fat kid in the waiting room? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what does he want? <laughs> <laughs> Hello to America and all the ships at sea. Ah, Jim Norton here. <laughs> Stay tuned for a new talent we have. Eric Nagel. Yes. <laughs> who, who He's now, to, what, 28 years old? Yeah, I guess. Yes. Something like that. Who has, to, 20, 20. who has to get this music? Who has to pull this music up? Iraq. So he has to help. <laughs> yeah. He has to yeah. help this. He has to help <laughs> fuck himself. Yeah. It's like your movie. He's having an impact on his own life. So I, so I run a radio station. And All right. What do I do? What's uh? Why is why is Jim in this to run a radio station? What happens at the radio station? Um. He hires a, a fucking middle-aged Scott Shannon. <laughs> 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 Get me that guy over there, the one with the rock head. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think radio is involved in this movie more than we're thinking. Oh, I no. think yeah, so, too. Yeah, I bet. That's where Opie's part comes in. I bet. Opie's the lead. I yeah. got a communist on my house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A-Rock, comment. No. Jim, Jim plays the GM. Um, oh. Some things happen way ahead of their time. And Jim can't handle it. But because Jim- of what this guy does? Yes, because of what this guy does. So you see yourself oh. as a real innovator in radio, and you no. come and set the world on fire? Mm-mm. Did you bring satellite radio to the 50s? Oh, man. No, it's yeah. Yeah. Why they have a satellite existed. podcasting. Oh. It's just a run off the Sputnik satellite. Hey, listen to channel 234 for beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Oh, he brings podcasting. Jim's character looks like less podcasting. Yeah. What is that? Something about the beans? <laughs> yeah, casting. Who broke their arm? What? What are you talking about? Who is this fat kid from the future? <laughs> <laughs> is the main character a bit overweight? No. Oh, uh, see an average sloth. Something. So something happens at the radio station in 19. 19- oh, 
Do you get up and fucking play Johnny B. Good? <laughs> no. For Marvin no, no, Berry? No, no. Come on. Beat it, spook. This don't concern you. Do you say that? No. Is he a racist? <laughs> no. You, somebody asked that Does yesterday. Does he live underwater? Is he black? No. Mm. <laughs> ah. All right, so... Um, I like this, though. It's not a scene, though. I'm, I'm the GM. What do I do? You get... Um, <laughs> You're very straight laced by the books kind of guy, ah. and uh, you throw um, oh. some big temper tantrums when certain things change beyond your control. Oh! Oh, damn! Yeah. Ah, fiddlestick. This is not what I said. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? You're not a man who likes change. You no, don't have a name. You don't have a, a pseudo name for this. You have to have the a, have a name. Title. He does. He's you do have the title. Time. He rock in the fifties. Do you inspire uh, the name of Chubby Checker? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> so it happens. Bob's I like boy. that name. <laughs> the guy who went back Come and invented on, good food. No, his na his neighbors are Bill Bill Domino and Fred Checker. <laughs> Inspired both of them. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> and he's from Minnesota. <laughs> What's that? I wonder what the title of the movie is. I know he's got a title. E Rock, could you just tell us the is, title, no, please? No. Is it called? It, does it have? Okay. Is the word time in the title? Nope. Is the word is is any food words in the title? Nope. Sliders is a food word. I understand that, <laughs> okay. but both is it, is both it, terms of sliders are right. not in this movie. Is it a one word title? No. Fuck. Is how it, many words? Is Give us pun. how many words, please. Ira, comment. Six. 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 Is the word, words. Is the is word <laughs> stop or my mom will shoot? Apparently, you're not making T-shirts for this movie. <laughs> <laughs> is, is there is the I word have a the Twitter account? <laughs> Is the word the, is it the, blah, 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 blah? Yeah. It's in it, yeah. The, oh, the... The 90-minute time travel movie. <laughs> oh, fuck! Is that it? Yes, you got it. Um, the fat kid who finally makes a difference. <laughs> 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 the movie with no comics casted. Ooh! Oh, oh, now you're out of the movie. Oh, now you're out you of out. the movie. Oh, come on. Oh, man. Jim Norton fucking... will not do that picture! <laughs> that's perfect for him. <laughs> It'll make him a big star! Yeah. <laughs> Acting lessons, eating lessons. Ah, shit. The ah. biggest mistake I ever made. <laughs> oh, is coming that here? It? Yeah. Oh, you actually are you telling titles? I think it's something <laughs> I you're just like being honest. <laughs> it's something like the uh, the not so typical adventures of the typical man, or you know, oh, something like that. Oh, is it? Is it a very fucking? <laughs> No, <laughs> you know, because that's the plot of the movie. He's just a typical guy. So it's the you know. <laughs> oh, I hate oh, it. Oh, 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 oh. Wait a minute, Iraq. E is the word life in the title? No. Fuck. But mm. I had it. It's like a crypto quote without any clues. The the. Is right, it, the first word is the. The, the movie script no, he said that the never is got in it. He didn't say it was the first word. It's the first word. Is it the movie what? script what? that never oh, got made? <laughs> story is story in it. No. Fuck. All right, so it's, it's love. Love. Uh, 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 is of in it? No. Is Obi? Uh, is his, uh, is his name <laughs> Obi? <laughs> yes. Obi. Uh, Obi. Obi. The, the Obi. Something. Something. It, da, is the, there? A, can I ask you a question? Is XL in it? Double X? No, you're not in the movie. No. Oh. 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 A fat oh, joke oh, from a fatty. Touche. <laughs> uh, uh, is the word back? No. Back fat. So it's something. <laughs> the is, oh. is the word past in it? Nope. Fuck Travel. Me. Travel. Nope. But the is in it. Adventure. It, one of the words is uh, rock in adventure. It. <laughs> no. Okay. The um um is lump in it? I'm not going it? to tell you. Shit. But you've you've been wrong up to this point. I'm not telling you the title. The. The shittiest movie you've ever seen in your life. Is that <laughs> the name of the movie? There you go. The, it's a parody. Uh, the 90 minute uh. shit fest. Hey. Uh, I don't know. This is no. this is annoying to not know this. The complete I idiots guys title. making a movie. Yeah, I want to know the uh. title so badly. E Rock? Eric loves this. Give us one more word. No. Oh, you know why Eric loves this? It's not this? gonna do anything. Because he's being vague and intriguing. Yes! And so That's the name. Oh god, it is. Vague and intriguing. Vague and the fat kid that was vague and <laughs> intriguing. The word change. Change. Change? No. Fuck man. Hmm. Doesn't Mist make any sense. Oh. Not so. It's not so. You know. Nope. It's not no. C. It's nope. Cheeseburgers. <laughs> not C. <laughs> yes, of. The cheeseburger. Is of in it. 
No. This doesn't that? make no sense. You that. asked that already. Yeah. Oh, bullshit movie. Is another, you, is don't another, worry about the title. Wait, is another common word like the in it? Like an of or a? is I or a? a. No. An. Yeah? No. no. So it's all like these weird words with a the. Is one of the words part of a name? No. Is it uh, Doctor Who fan fiction? Let's be honest. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh, come on. You being honest? I'm right. definitely being honest. Okay. When, when are you going to be done with it? Do you have a time oh, timeline? Yes, coming. You're right. Monday. Will you be done by Monday? When are you no, going to be done? I won't be done by have Monday. you fired up the software yet? I've installed it. <laughs> You've installed it. Yes. Rolling, rolling. <laughs> sat down in front of the computer and started typing, tickling do the old not, keys. Do you know how to use the software? No, I just got it. You know, it's real difficult to figure it out at the beginning. If you, need, if, you need, if you need help, let me know. I'm sure it is. And I, I was it. thinking once he wrote it, yeah. like he could write it in a timely fashion, yeah. and it would be something that we would actually be able to act out on the show. That'd be uh, great. Like old school radio, we have some sound effects, and it would, you know, we could we, do the whole movie. We do it live, yeah. like a live event. Yeah. Ooh, would that you, could be our next live event. Is that cool, Eric? Would you get the movie ready for a live event? I, Iraq? I don't have a timeline on this yet. Can we do a table read of it? Once I have something done, I think I can do something. Have to. Can we, can we do a, Wait a minute. Ask him again. Can we do a buffet table read of it? <laughs> yeah, you sure. Roland, uh, <laughs> Roland thinks he knows the title of the movie. What is it? What does Roland say? I left my hoagie in San Francisco. <laughs> <laughs> is that the name? Is he trying to get his hoagie back after he falls through the sliders thing? No. Uh, someone says, is it Sisterhood of the Really Big Traveling Pants? <laughs> 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 the fish man again. Jesus. Uh, am I, uh, am, what's my name in it? I don't have a name. That's a I've good one. That That's a good one. These cocksuckers are funny ah. motherfuckers with their phone <laughs> Iraq that's great it sounds like a hit to me is Ed Bo Wood. Derek in it no <laughs> she ever <have> leg bitten off <laughs> Jesus <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> what a fucking reference <laughs> uh, shit <laughs> uh. <laughs> um are you, Wait, no, 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 no. Are, you saying, uh, are you in it? Um, I said a bad cigars grief. and scotch is asking: Is it Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Plate? That's a good one. Here they come. Here, yes, they, come. here they come. Is it a, a, um, a clockwork ham? <laughs> uh, and here they he come. He rock. God, Any scenes in the mall? Does he go to the mall? No. There was no malls back then. Maybe we go from the 40s, the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, 2000s, 2010s. There's malls in the 70s. But he's in the fucking... Um, in a mall. He's in the uh, radio station a lot. No. No, yes, that's in, the in, thing. In one particular time, he is. He oh. just fucks something so up you're, and so you're just in the, in the, the changes the future. You're in the movie once. Radio. He, probably hands somebody, he probably hands somebody. He probably has a job at the radio and he plays something he shouldn't play. Yeah. Why don't you play this? Yeah. Oh, no, what's he doing? I'm pulling my hair out in the other room. Oh, boy, nerds. <laughs> <laughs> nerds. Who is this mystery fat kid? Ah. Bow tie and suspenders. Well, he is overweight, the character. No. A, li a little. No. <laughs> a little chubby. No. Can I play him? Uh, the Misadventures of the Mysterious Fat Kid. Oh, shit. <laughs> Who gets stuck in a slider's portal. Oh. And they have to kick him through. Mm. Uh, all right. Is it uh, Lord of the Onion Rings? <laughs> Yeah, How about the blob? It. <laughs> <laughs> Did you say the blob? It. I'm so glad. I'm I'm so close to this, but I'm so far away. This, I'm sorry, Eric, but <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> oh, this is the Lord of the Onion Rings. Hey, Rock, come on, man. You gotta give us more. We're fucking. We're digging this. You I'm, got it yourself a good movie. I'm sounds glad awesome. You like this? That sounds I'm awesome. To to I love time travel movies, by the way. I just saw Looper a couple of, about last week, and it, and it was very cool. No I'm worried that there's travel. not enough time travel. It seems like it happens once in the beginning, and then that's it. He just Looper? loses his life. No. Uh, oh, this guy. In, uh, I like Slider's that, too. Yeah, I like that, that, he's, that he has to go back once, and then he has to get back to where he was, but in real time. But we back don't have to, to sit the future. I'm that's sending good. you back. Yeah, sit here for 70 years. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That sounds a little dull. We have one more word in the title. Yeah, come on, ah, Iraq. No, two one two word. words out of six is not that much. One Fudge word is wrestling in the title. <laughs> <laughs> McMahon. No. no. Right. Iraq. Incompetent. Titties. Burden. <laughs> Elephant. Lesbos. Uh, distracted. <laughs> Fan fiction. 
There's Lego on the title. <laughs> is it a series like Harry Pot Roast? <laughs> <laughs> Did you use the word Coke or float? <laughs> no. Yeah. What state does it take place in? Like what uh, state? New, um, New York City. Oh, does he ever? New York City and L.A. He has what? never traveled like south or like like in Florida or yeah. anything like that. What does he take the Pan Am Clipper over? Yeah. Does he fly over to just meet with the big movie producer real quick? Yeah. Is he a filmmaker in the film? Is it self-reflexive? Are there any Waltz. historical uh, events that happen? That he causes, yes. Not that he interacts mm, with. Good he question, causes, Bob. He causes a historical event. Does he cause historical Can events that really <laughs> did? Does he, bump, <laughs> does he bump into the World Trade Centers? <laughs> <laughs> Do these events actually, are they events that actually happen in real life, or does he cause new historical events? Um, That's a good question. New. There, there's, there's one or two new things that happen. Iraq, hold on. Yeah. Does he fucking tell uh, the people at the airport in Boston that there's terrorists no. getting on a plane? Why? No, because he, he doesn't interfere with shit that are... Why, Why the like fuck that? wouldn't he Why? stop 9-11? Why wouldn't he stop 9-11? Because he doesn't care. Is what? it... Oh, an asshole's tale rogue. of time travel? Iraq. He's a rogue time traveler. <laughs> Iraq, why doesn't he care? It was 9-11. Everybody cares about 9-11, except assholes. Your movie's unpatriotic. Yeah. You hate America and the soldiers. You're yeah. telling me this guy didn't call him Freedom Fries for a little while? No. Yeah. What a dick. Iraq, <laughs> why wouldn't you fucking... Why wouldn't he stop 9-11? Stop 9-11. It would be easy. He could be a hero. Mm. Hero. <laughs> He could be a hero. <laughs> He's not. A, is he an anti-hero? Iraq. Wouldn't people wonder why he didn't stop 9/11? Uh, it might. You could, I guess, view him sort of as uh, of an anti-hero because it's all about himself. I would view him oh, as a villain. villain. He's, he's selfish. Not, he's not knowing what he knows. He's not there to help other people. Why? Because he's he only wants to help himself. Why? Have a hateable lead character. <laughs> <laughs> Who didn't stop nine eleven? He didn't stop nine yeah, eleven. That doesn't make sense. You gotta have so you have to have a likable guy. And why am I gonna watch the movie? A you, ninety you, minute you'll, movie. You'll Better. like him, but no, I won't. for the wrong reasons. Oh, does love he, to hate him? Uh, yeah. Does he call NASA and tell him there's gonna be a problem with Apollo thirteen? Nope. What a dick. What an asshole this What's guy he do? is. What a fuck. Jesus what do he do? Just, he just he just rules the world. No. Do people know that he's from the future? No. Oh, so nobody's like, why wouldn't you tell us about 9-11, dick? That doesn't happen. Yeah. Does he stop Columbine? No. Nope. Does he stop he Francis Ford Coppola from putting his daughter in fucking Godfather 3? <laughs> Does he stop Newtown? <laughs> Does he no. stop Newtown? Come on. He doesn't stop Newtown? Does he nope. stop new kids in the block? <laughs> oh. They wouldn't have banned guns for Anthony if I he know. had stopped Newtown. What a prick this character yeah. is. Write your own movie. I don't then. like it. Yeah, you're a real pud. What an asshole. I say we read all read a movie against the, this movie. The, ass, <laughs> the asshole through time. That's a good title. It should be. What a what a dickhead this guy is. Yeah. Does he fucking? He doesn't save anybody. Well, I bet he kills people like Jack Lalanne and all those other troublemakers. Does he? <laughs> Does he kill anyone? <laughs> Jack Lalanne. <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> Does he kill anyone? Does he kill anyone? Comment, D Rock. No, Ooh. I didn't write anything down about killing anybody. Does he interact with Malcolm X? No. Does he fucking uh, keep uh, Martin Luther King from being killed? Nope. He doesn't change Robert certain Kennedy in history. No. No. Does he stop uh, plane crashes? Nope. Tell people there's problems. He doesn't help humanity. Why? Can you imagine going back in time? Selfish. Oh, it really is autobiographical. <laughs> <laughs> Does he stop a couple from going in a church? Oh yeah, that would be good. Please. Yeah, right. <laughs> no, that fucking cock he stops a tape from being delivered at BAB. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's terrible. Can you imagine yeah. going oh. back in time and having that little impact? <laughs> and literally everything just happened just the way you read anyway. about it, like. I can imagine being in time now and having little impact. Really? You have the option to go back in time. One thing he does. One thing. You don't thing. find that interesting that he knows certain things would happen and he just watches it happen, doesn't do anything about no, it. No, it's no. sociopathic. Right. That's yeah. dumb. The only way that's interesting. have already seen that. Do you show him crying on a rock yeah, as the buildings all go down? That. Yeah. Huh? What? I'm sorry. Do you show him crying on a rock watching the buildings go down? No, he no. doesn't care. He doesn't. So he doesn't even give a shit. No, I know a what it's about. It's no. about a guy who goes back and doesn't change anything, because he knows he's ineffective in life. It's about a guy accepting his own mediocrity 
and his own. <laughs> But wouldn't something over the course of 70 years nope. make him realize, Jesus. wait a minute, nope. I could actually do it's his, something. It's very autobiographical. It's he got a man accepting his mediocrity and doing nothing to change so anything he gets, around him. But as he's getting older, he doesn't change. He doesn't have a different thought when he's fucking 50 than nope. he did when he's 18 and decide maybe I'll start helping people. Nope. This is starting to sound terrible. Yeah. Awful. You just basically, it's a what time a one a character. Slider, Porter, it? A time yeah. traveling well, gelatinous mess. Beginning. Yeah. What the fuck, Iran? What a one-dimensional character. No. He doesn't change at all during the course of the he film? He changes, but not to help what anybody else. What if he buys stock in Apple? In the, end, no. <laughs> in the end, does he get better? Um, yeah, in the Does end. he get on a shortwave radio and but, talk to his son? <laughs> how could anybody, how could anybody like movie. him in the end? <laughs> in the end, you're supposed to like him. Yeah, what does he do? But you still know that he didn't stop 9-11 or Newtown or Columbine. He's a cock sucker. Yeah. He's, He's a, a room fucking for a asshole. Sequel. What a dickhead. No. No sequel. If he falls in a slider's portal at the end, there is. So think about it right now. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> <Does it> <laughs> not, and he goes like this as he's falling. Not again. And then, uh, you know. and then power of love kicks in. Right. And everybody walks out. Right. Does it. Woo! Here I <laughs> Yeah. Roll credits. <laughs> Written by... Iraq. <laughs> Eric Iraq Nagel. Are the words are the words sex or bagel in the title? No. Okay. Does the Iraq video uh, thing end <laughs> the movie? This is like the one. YouTube video. This is the movie I want him to remember <laughs> me for. He probably invents like Nintendo and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Iraq forgot to write 9/11 into the script, but it has Sega Genesis. It's like. Iraq. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty-two bits. <laughs> That's impossible. <laughs> dun, 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 Does he invent dun, Sega Genesis? No. Sonic the Hedgehog? No. Tails? ColecoVision? Atari? No. Sonic Pinball? Does he just go back and play these video games? Uh, Toe Jam and Earl? Does he, does he let... All right. NBA Does Jam. he hook up with a girl at any point? Yes. All right. Does he tell her anything about his time-traveling exploits? Um... Not directly, no. No. Well, but, yeah, but she, yeah, plum cuckoo. as time goes on, she figures out she, certain things. She, oh. Uh, how does she figure uh, it out? Because he's doing like I'm some not fucking. You. He goes down on her, and that was just wasn't done back then. <laughs> did what she are you ever? Doing now? What are you doing now? Did she oh ever? Oh my goodness, get, that feels good. <laughs> did she ever get to a point where she's like, I can't believe I spent my life with a person who didn't stop 9/11 from happening? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or Martin Luther King from being killed, yeah, or, yeah. or fucking Kennedy. Yeah. Um, he just keeps saying, "Watch what happens tomorrow." Oh, I, yeah. bet, I bet he just goes and photographs all these things. So he has the best pictures ever. Right. Like he has a great new angle of the fucking Zapruder film. Is he cub report? John Lennon gets shot, and his yeah. chick is just like, "Are you fucking telling me you could have stopped that?" He's like, "Yeah, but I got him to sign something first. Oh, right? Oh. God, <laughs> look at this photo of him falling down. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He has some fake charities getting things signed for him. <laughs> <laughs> How long? That's is, what the movie is. He's just getting autographs and pictures. How long is he with charity. the girl? <laughs> um, she she stays with him through <laughs> most of the movie. Wait, wait. So he picks her up in the late forties. Uh, this, no, a little, little later than that. So she's got like old? a poodle skirt. Maybe in t uh, right, yeah, in she's the like, late fifties. Ah, where does he meet her at the hop when she's Wait. seventeen and he's thirty three? Yeah. yeah, he's at late fifties into the sixties. So that's the sixties. So in the late forties, he's twenty. He's nineteen around 19. there. So he's so he, about he, thirty. He meets her in his thirties. Sandy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What happens? They meet and they fall in love on a beach, and then he gets in trouble for jerking off the masseuse. <laughs> <laughs> People want to see young love. They don't want to see somebody meet yeah, what is a that? woman of their dreams deep this? into their 30s. Exactly. He rocks. When Friday met Sally. And then not and stop 9-11. Hey, uh, Iraq, is yeah. any of this helping you? This no. is probably helping, right? No. No, knowing that the things not to do and things you have to do. Uh, do you run yeah, into a lot of this wasn't even planned to do. Do you run in and tell your wife everything that's happening as it's happening and annoy her while she's watching TV? Oh, my God. I have an idea. While she's oh, watching sports. It. So guess what happens next? Hey, you better stay away from downtown today. Ah, oh, right. Down. Oh, yeah. Vague idiot. <laughs> that's very vague. Yeah. The vague, vague idiot. Maybe Is that the name vague. of it? Yeah. The vague idiot. The vague Is idiot in a bunch of different times. And his time-traveling yeah. adventures. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. he, caught, he did. He tried to stop 9-11, but he was too vague. Yeah. He called yeah. the vague. airport like, something's happening. Hey, uh, <laughs> something's up. That guy looks weird, right? Are you letting people on the plane today? Yeah. 
I don't know. Oh. Hey, you watching the news later? <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, uh, you're gonna be uh, you're gonna be checking people um, for um, weapons online. Yes. Atta boy. Atta boy. <laughs> what did you say? Atta boy. What the fuck does that mean? Exactly. <laughs> Gotta go. Gotta go. Click and he hangs up. He, goes, what, he should get it. He what, should get it. I bet he gets it. What inspired you to make the movie? Like, what movies inspired you to start writing? Yeah. Nothing. It's it's something an idea I had a long time ago, and I just finally twelve monkeys notes down. Where's the twelve monkeys? Twelve chunky monkeys. I've never seen twelve monkeys. <laughs> Have you seen the show no, Sliders? It's great. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking sliders. It just sounds a lot like sliders. <laughs> Oh, it sounds like every time travel movie. Yeah, that so. Jerry O'Connell has been in. Sal, what do you think? You liking? Uh, oh, can Sal I tell you something? This. Sal told me in the phone screen room. First of all, he's been crying, laughing. He's, he's been, been giddy. He laughed all afternoon, and he told me he was lying in bed last night, going to sleep, and he started giggling to himself about this movie. <laughs> Sal's overreacting to this. Yeah. Sal, what do you think? Maybe you think, he's uh, maybe Sal comes from the future and he's seen oh, Iraq movies shit. flop. Oh shit! Or maybe he saw it was a hit and wants to undermine Iraq's fame and fortune. Oh, ah, he's here to destroy Iraq, the filmmaker. I cannot wait to see this film. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I'm so it's excited. Sick, good one. Sick. What? Uh, yeah. What, so I heard you. You were you were absolutely giddy yesterday. I was crying. Yeah. I was yeah. absolutely crying. It, I think it's just such a huge undertaking to try to pull this off. Wouldn't you? Yeah, you know, he, he, I, I hate to say this, but Sal's got a point, Iraq. Wouldn't you start with something <laughs> a little uh, easier, a little easier to write? Start with like a and cast, and it's about all, all about dialogue, you know, like yeah. something heavy on dialogue. You not know that what? Much on acting. No, Iraq, don't write with limitations. These yeah. guys are trying to. <laughs> you're not trying. You're just all you're doing is writing. Everything in your imagination should be able to spill out on that. That's paper. right. That's Iraq. what editing's for. Yeah, that's not your job to make this thing. You're that's writing true. it. That's and true. if you want to write sliders into a movie, write sliders into a movie. Yeah. I, I was a little bit behind, but I heard that the guy uh, doesn't change anything in history. This no, is a new detail. No. He doesn't <laughs> stop 9 11. He doesn't stop happening. anything? Nothing. No, Nothing. Martin Luther King still dies. 9 11 still happens. JFK. Because he's the same selfish guy at 18 as he is at 70. That's so right. the character doesn't learn anything. No. No, no, no. no character growth. He's There's a no selfish here. lump. I wonder no, this advancement, is no character advancement. No arc. Does he grow, Eric? He grows as a person later. You know? <laughs> what does he learn? Because every every character needs to learn something. Later, like learn? after 2001? That's when 9-11 happened. <laughs> yeah. He should have been great. He's going to be an old man by 9-11. Yeah. It's like 60. Yeah. He should have done his growing by then. Oh, God. That's the autumn of his life. I fucking hate this. He's not telling us. Terrible movie. The name of the movie. <laughs> Everything. Then don't watch I'm a fucking... It's called I'm a fucking prick. I'm we're an not, asshole prick. We're not going to have a guy. choice not to watch it. Yeah. We're going to act it out on the show. Iraq, when... Am I in will it? pen hit paper. Where's Iraq? Yeah. Iraq. Am I in it? Eric. Is there any roles for your friends? Like, other than of Jim? Of course there is. Iraq, yeah. when will pen hit paper on this? When soon. are you, you know, starting? Soon. Soon. What do you mean soon? Soon. You, how about tonight? Yeah, why don't you start tonight? How about mind your business? It'll be done when it's done. Oh, that's right. What the fuck? That's the attitude. Who's telling you that? Not rush me. genius. Oh, you're, you're probably right. Yeah, you can't rush genius. No. That's true. Yeah. Well. Yeah, but you can just have him write this movie real quick. It's true. At least the title. Yeah, at least yeah. the title. Main character. Yeah. Scratching well, off all the sliders references right now. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, you figured to, it out. I'd love to just go on and on and on about this. Uh, yeah, but I gotta yes. take a piss. I can't yeah. believe there's six words in the title. That's the, I long, know. the longest, <laughs> the longest title long ever. What one, the fuck could it be? One of those long titles. It's just, ugh, why?